I have this Cruella de Vil kind of twisted look a little bit. This is more along the lines of if she was kind of done as the Disney princess instead of the villain. That makes any sense. A little bit more youthful, a little bit more glamorous, not quite as evil. But I'm gonna let past Evie take over and take you through how to do this. Okay guys, first things first, you're gonna wanna block out your brows. If you do want a tutorial, I will have one linked below. Then you just wanna cover it so you do not have any of your original eyebrows on. Now with some Anastasia Beverly Hill Dip Brow in granite, you're just gonna wanna draw on some really over the top, quite arched, quite dramatic eyebrows as Cruella has some intense spaghetti brows going on. Once you're finished with the first brow, it's time to do the second. Now, once you're happy with your brows, it's time to get onto the eyes. So I'm using the Revolution Makeup Sophie Collaboration Palette and just some NYX eyeshadow base and going in with shadows Cookie Dough, Lakes and Brownies, I'm just doing quite an intense kind of brown smoky eye. I guess it's not really smoky, but just brown eye. Kind of giving myself a bigger looking eyelid, if that makes any sense. Then going in with some concealer, wow, I struggled to say that. I'm just going in and cutting out kind of the middle section to create a high halo eye. Wow, I am really struggling today. Then in with the NYX pigments, I'm going in with Insomnia first, which is a nice light green, and then a darker green, which is Kryptonite just on the outside to kind of blend it into the brown a little bit more. And then in with just a liquid liner, giving yourself a decent wing if you can do it. If not, don't stress. And then going in with a NYX Jumbo Pencil and just darkening the bottom waterline. And just putting a bit of foundation everywhere, doing quite a light skin tone as Cruella is quite a pale gal. And then just contouring a little bit drastic, like trying to make you look a little bit more gaunt than nicely contoured, if that makes any sense as well as giving yourself a really nice thin bridge of your nose. Cruella also has quite a pointed nose. However, I wasn't gonna put a prosthetic on for this. So I'm really just trying to make the tip of my nose look as pointed as I possibly can with a contour, just to really over dramatize the entire nose. Now I'm just going in because I have a no self control and applying a little bit of highlighter. I'm going into all the places you'd usually put highlighter and then pretty much the entirety of my face because when it comes to highlighter, I really don't know when to stop. And then just putting on some false lashes and a very dramatic red lip. I'm just using the Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in Outlaw. I'm pretty sure that's the name of this one. And just giving myself quite an intense Cupid's bow as Cruella does have a really intense Cupid's bow. And once you are happy with that, guys, it's just time to go in and pop on a wig. I have this really cute kind of half black, half white bob wig that I got. I will leave a link to the actual wig that I did get down below if you are interested in getting it. So there we go, guys. This is my finished Cruella de Vil kind of twist video, if you know what I mean. I kind of described it at the start. I thought I'd do something a little bit more fun and a little bit more makeup y for a, just something a little bit different. But if you did enjoy this tutorial, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you do not miss out on any of the 31 days of Halloween I have coming for you this October. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.